Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to explain connector simulation in Pega. Uh, let us consider a requirement call. You are doing a bank application. So you want a credit score for the particular person based on the PAN card number. But there is a problem is, there is an external system is not available. External system is not available. In that scenario, we have to give the dummy data to the application and they have to simulate the connector. There are mainly two types of connector. One is soap connector, another one is rest connector. In this video, I am using the rest connector simulation to uh, get the data. Like uh, if I enter the PAN card number, I get the details of the credit score. Let's open the PEGA and here the case type call credit score. Just say one run. In this, I should enter the PAN card number of the particular person. Uh, after that, they will fetch the details of the credit score, name, and number of accounts open, like that. So if I enter like uh, Sanjay123, and I click on save, uh, it will automatically fetch the data related to the PAN card. So first of all, you go to the data type and create a data type. name is credit score observe uh, you should expand this advanced tab i am creating this particular data type in the integ integration class in this integration class there are so many other methods to do this simulation. I am taking this type of method because I want the integration like uh, so I decided to do in the integration class. Just click on save add fields. I am adding pan number. Enter. Pan number. And score. Or credit score and you can give total accounts you can take another field it's only demo purpose I'm only taking this one just click on save and go to records then configure source <laughs> you have to give the primary key uh, that is PAN number is a unique, so I'm giving it and submit. So three pages are automatically populated. Just click on save and go to the integration class app and search for the int. Create it on the int create score. Just expand the data model and data page. So I want one particular person record. That's why I'm using the single page. If you want more than one person, you can go through the page list. So in this scenario, I want only one particular person detail. So I'm going to the page. Okay, just go to simulate data source enable. Before that, you have to create the connector rule. Just right click on this class. Create. Connector, I'm creating connect trust <laughs> and give you a name as get score. Get score test and create and open and just click on save <laughs> and just scroll down. You can observe there is a simulation button is there. Just click on it. It will open a pop-up window. Just click on this plus icon. It will add a row. And I am calling activity get score. I'm creating activity in this place. Get score. Just click on crosser icon. It will open. And it should be in the integration class. Power 1. Integrate create score. Just create and open. and here you can apply the data transform here i'm using the data transform for the logic you can use decision table decision tree any any is i'm using the data transform just expand this and dt score data transform score just click on crosshair icon it will open the data transform rule 
just create an open okay i should pass the parameters that is the parameter in the data page for no confusion you can copy the parameter for this or you can give any parameter i am copy pasting here it's the string and just when click on the settings and go to this browse option expand this properties expand this parameter page plus icon here is equal to is equal to uh, is in a string form and uh, one one two three and card number is power one one two three just click on submit and dot grade score should be 865 i am taking random values and plus dot total accounts one account and another logic just copy this and right click here and paste below is the pan code number is anj123 credit score should be 754 and total bank accounts 2 just click on save the data transform is completed should pass the same parameters here and it's in the string form so you should enable this checkbox pass current parameters and click on save then go back to the connector and uh, i'm using it for user section you should select a global all users should use i'm using the user section only me as a user can use okay i am selecting this radio button and submit you should observe there is nothing matter is available here when i clicking on save So you can observe there is number of simulation defined one act two section simulation is here so we successfully simulated the rush connector okay just get back to the data page and get here apply source activity just copy this activity id and paste here just click on save and here parameter section open the parameters and click the checkbox pass current parameters then click submit we have to check the data so database is successfully created so you should go to the work class and just right click on this create score create data model i am creating a property property name is score details or create score details and create and open it should be single page i am single page and page definition should be per one one in create score why because i am referring to a data page the data page under this class just click on down arrow in order to fetch the page so d underscore score one it's our page okay here the pan card parameter just expand this and go to data model property just copy this pan number just click on dot paste here just click on save and go to actions set as mark as relevant mark as relevant and save 
just go to the credit score case type and open this configuration <coughs> search for the credit score details field yeah here it is then click on plus icon it will automatically add i am creating a section here credit underscore details create so i don't want this bank card number i only want this credit score and total accounts just click on submit save let's save and run and i am passing pan code number here like the pan code number is power 123 that's the logic i given yeah the logic is pan power 123 yeah to region click on save it will fetch the data from the logic so if i give the another logic that is sanjay 123 in sanjay 123 just click on save and it fetch the that is 754 and number of accounts let's check the logic just go to transfer data transform uh, if the parameter that means the pan card number is sanjay 123 the credit score should be 754 and total accounts too yeah check it check here is this correct yeah so this is the process of fresh connector simulation Uh, I simply explain the once again the concept. Uh, what is the background process they are doing? We simply created a case type, and for the case type we created the data type. Uh, the data type is under the integration class. Why? Because we are simulating the integration connector. So I am creating the data type under the integration class. Like I am assuming the um, database uh, in the integration class. So I am creating a database. and added a data model fields and created a records for the unique key that is primary key is pan number and then if i am taking a single page then automatically pega creates a three pages one is page list and saveable i am using the page because i want the one person detail for based on the one pan code number so go to this just click on this simulate and i am created integration class under the integration just go to the integration grid in this class i am created the integration connector rule okay this is the integration connector rule so i am saving here and just scroll down and click on the simulate i am entering the activity why because it's fetch for the activity and search for the logic and submitting here and it go to the activity and pass the parameters and the activity calls the data transform the data transform is consist of parameters that is pan card number pan card number will go to this place and it fetch for the logic if the pan card number is pan 123 it fetch the these these details and if the pan card number is sanjay 123 it fetch the these details so uh, after that i am created the page a single page property in the work class i am create a single page property in the work class uh, the page definition should be the integer integration class why because the page is, uh, means uh, the data page in the integration class that's why i am giving the page definition should be integration and i am referring to the page the page should be the we create we simulated page and give the page here and we pass the parameter parameter means pan number there is a pan number in this case type it is under the work class so it's a pan number. all request for my side guys if you like my video and explanation please subscribe to my channel and share to your like of friends and this video i think this video will helpful to those who are doing interns in the tcs uh, so many subscribers are asking for this requirement and they are asking for soap integration also i will do to that video Uh, and if you have any doubts please comment below and that's all for this video guys bye bye